Baby Joe Space Activist, and today I'm going to be talking about how Caterpillar inspired the early space suit design in the 1940s. So, let's get right into it. Carlin was in his garden when he when he saw a, a, just a whole new caterpillar go across a branch. Okay, there was a whole new caterpillar going across a branch, and he was like, the caterpillar's um, body, as you can see right here, is divided into segments. And now, because a major problem back then is the spacesuit, you can't be flexible, and the spacesuit was stiff. So he thought about the caterpillar's body. The caterpillar's body can move easily. It can be flexible, and because its body was divided into segments. So then he made the Goodrich X5 spacesuit inspired by the Caterpillar, and it was divided into segments, and you can see the spacesuit right here. And it was actually divided into segments, just like the Caterpillar, and that meant it could move really, really, really good. But it actually originated from something so small as a Caterpillar to something as big as a spacesuit, and something that was innovative, and something that could actually change what we've been doing. So that's why, that's how a Caterpillar inspired an early spacesuit design. Now, um, Russell Colley, you can see him right here, this is Russell Colley. He was the one that um, inspired, um, he was the one that made the Russell, uh, he helped make the X, uh, Goodrich X5 spacer. Uh, he was in, he ins but he got inspired by it by just looking at a caterpillar in his garden. So, that's how he got inspired by it. And guess what, like, um, so uh, before you don't notice something very small, think about how this caterpillar inspired something as big as the spacesuit and something so innovative. And now the government kind of would like the idea of it and his team did. So they did use that for space, like that spacesuit. It did go pretty well. It did go pretty well. So uh, that's basically how it inspired it. And don't forget to leave a like, comment, and subscribe. And thanks for watching.